right good day this is kavita assistant professor of electrical and electronics engineering department tyagaraj college of engineering in this video we are going to simulate a fuse we know each electrical equipment wires have their own electrical ratings if large current flows through them they will get damaged hence fuse is used as a protective device you might have seen a fuse with different ratings now we are going to simulate the fuse using fit app for that the app i am android user i am going to google play and i am going to type fit so it is a pet simulation app and if you see it is a chemistry and physics simulation app with kivix team so i am going to install this app once after you install this you can go to your apps and you can select phet pet so it will open the pets interactive simulation in which more number of physics and chemistry applications are simulated here i am going to select circuit construction kit using a dc virtual lab so for simulating a simple dc circuit we can go in this lab so now i am loading this particular lab and i am going to start a simple circuit so here some list of components will be there battery resistor light bulb so everything will be here and if you want to see the current flow while simulating and labels and the value of the things you can check these things so for designing the circuit now i am taking the necessary thing so now i am taking the battery so here it is the default value is 9 volt we can change it to any volt so now i am just for simulating i am just taking the dc voltage source of 120 volts then i am going to take a switch so i am connecting a switch to the battery source and now the switch is open condition and so the resistance is infinity and then i am going to connect a fuse so we are going to simulate a fuse so i am just going to take a fuse and i am connecting a fuse here if you need you can connect resistor here i am just connecting the bulb so you just take the bulb and you just connect the bulb to the circuit so here what is this circuit consist of the circuit consist of batteries which and the fuse and the bulb and the bulb default resistance is here it is mentioned as 10 ohms so here i have applying 120 volts and here the bulb resistance is 10 ohms so as per ohms law if you are having here this fuse is going to have very small resistance that can be negligible so if the resistance of fuse is neglected the current through the circuit will be 120 volts by 10 ohms it will be equal to 12 amperes so now i am clicking the fuse and here you can set the fuse rating so here the maximum 12 amps can be flow so i am here i am setting the value of the fuse as 15 amps so i i am connecting here 15 amps fuse so now i am selecting a wire and i am going to close the circuit so the wire is taken and the circuit is closed so here what we are doing is we are just simulating the closing the circuit now the circuit is completely closed as you seen we have connected a battery and then a switch and then a fuse and the light lamp so now i am trying to close the switch so now i am have closed the switch and the current flow here the electron flow is shown 
the direction of electron flow is reverse to the current flow if you want to see the current flow you can click in this table whether you want a conventional flow or a electrons flow so now i have clicked the conventional flow so the flow of current is in this direction and the light is glowing now i am just switching off so now the switch is in off condition now what i am going to do is i am going to set the fuse amps to 10 amps to 4.5 amps so now what is happening here now i am closing the switch at the instant of closing the switch the fuse has gone and the bulb is not glowing from which what we can understand is the fuse rating is now 4.5 amps but the current flowing through the circuit is about 12 amperes so the fuse wire melt and it opens the circuit and there will be no net current flown through the circuit that it protects all other equipments if excess current flows through it so this is how we we are simulating a fuse right thank you